we're asked to evaluate the following integral over the region R. We have the double integral over the region R of 2x differential A, where the region R is given using polar coordinates, where R is greater than or equal to three and less than or equal to six, and the angle theta is greater than or equal to three-fourths pi and less than or equal to three-halves pi. Because the region R is given using polar coordinates, it'll be much easier to evaluate the double integral if we use polar coordinates. When converting to polar coordinates, remember differential A is equal to R d R d theta, and the function two x must be written as a function of R and theta. So let's go ahead and set this up. X is equal to R cosine theta, and therefore two x is two R cosine theta. And then differential A again is equal to R d R d theta. The limits of integration for R are from three to six. The limits of integration for theta are from three-fourths pi to three-halves pi. Let's go ahead and rewrite this. R times R is equal to R squared. And therefore the integrand function is two R squared cosine theta. And now let's evaluate this on the next slide. We first integrate with respect to r, treating theta as a constant, which gives us two times r cubed divided by three times cosine theta, which is two thirds r cubed cosine theta. Now we need to find big F of six minus big F of three, and we perform substitution for r, not theta, since we just integrated with respect to r. Big F of six is equal to two thirds times the cube of six cosine theta minus big F of three, which is equal to two thirds times the cube of three cosine theta. And two thirds times a cube of six minus two thirds times a cube of three is equal to 126, giving us a difference of 126 cosine theta. The integral of 126 cosine theta with respect to theta is equal to 126 sine theta. Now we find big F of three halves pi minus big F of three fourths pi, which gives us 126 times the difference of sine three halves pi and sine of three fourths pi which is equal to 126 times. The sine of 3 halves pi is negative one, minus the sine of 3 fourths pi, which is square root two divided by two. If we need to, we can check the unit circle. The sine of 3 halves pi is the y coordinate of negative one, and the sine of 3 fourths pi is equal to the y coordinate of square root two divided by two. So this would be the exact value, or if we convert to a decimal, rounded to four decimal places, we have approximately negative 215.0955. I hope you found this helpful.